Hey, I'm back, and I'm back in Polya. Was gonna open Cyberpunk, but let me warn you, the next video of Cyberpunk's gonna be, like, super long, because there's a lot I gotta get in on that, and not just that, but, well, I kinda had a lot to do today, so I am feeling a little stressed. And I haven't even finished it. I mean, I had to go to school to work out. I had to get a lot, I gotta get a lot of schoolwork done. And I had to go grocery shopping, and when I, and there's still a lot of cleaning I gotta do. So needless to say, I don't have time to stream a long game of cyberpunk. So you're getting Polya. I will now open the mailbox. Dear Karen, here's a little something as thanks for your continued patronage. Pal, come, come spend it all in one place. Mine. You just received a coin from Zeki. Use it on the wondrous machine inside his shop for a prize. Dear Corinne, heard you set up your smelter. Good job. As she's got this program she set up to encourage investing in Kilma's infrastructure or something. Anyways, what it means for you is a little rebate on the price of your first recipe. Keep it up. Let's mark this as red too. Okay, yeah, I don't have 500G yet, but let's check on this smeltering device. All right, quest completed. And I gotta water the plants, cause I still need that 500G. Inventory's full, of course. I should get rid of these stupid rugs. Guess I can't. Hold on, let me see what else I can do for the quest. Gotta finish building my house. Oh, I need the sapwood plank. So I'm not, I don't have a full basket anymore. Ugh. I can't. Just watered those. Maybe I can fish for a bit. Yeah, sell a few fish. Okay, come on, fish. Bite, bite, bite. That was a false alarm. Okay. okay, I cannot let it go. I cannot pull it back after one bite. Need to remember that. <sighs> Keeps tricking me. Okay, fishing here, way more complicated than it is in Dreamlight Valley. 
and try this again. When it comes back, I'll officially have 500G. Let's see, when will I be getting the G? 10 minutes. Well, that's plenty of time. Right now, I gotta give five gifts to villagers and see if anyone else wants me. I won't be surprised if 10 minutes to load the screen. Okay, it didn't take that long. Let's see. Does anybody need me? Looks like nobody needs me. check out Zeki's machine real quick. Not like I'm doing anything else. Where's the arcade machine? Ugh, can't get the backpack yet. Well, I have, oh, that's what to buy. See the lucky coin. Oh, here it is. Oops. Oh, hey, I got more arrows. Let's see, gift to villagers. Don't think you can give Zeki anything. Maybe Beiru. No, oh, his name's a uh, Badru. Nice of you to turn if. I hope you've been reaping good harvest lately. Chat with Badru. Uh -huh. It's hard to be mad at life when the sky looks like this, don't you think? Look at that cloud. What do you think it looks like? An adorable Armu. An Armu, huh? Yeah, I can see it. Looks a bit like an Armu needs to lay off the feet. All 
right, let's see. What should I give him? Uh. No hard feelings, but also no thanks. I can't believe Zeki raised prices on tomato seeds again. At this rate, we're just going to have to take tomatoes out of crop rotation. Oh, I see your hailing carrots for some seeds. Okay, so he wants tomato seeds. It might be easy. I can just buy that from the general store. Getting tomato seeds. Okay, he is not in the building, like I might have thought. If you keep visiting this often, I'll have to start calling you my best buddy. Ah. Seeds, sweet. Uh. Or savory. Depends on whether these seeds are for fruits, vegetables, or something else entirely. And I'll see you around. See, what about Rat? Ah. Funny seeing you here. Or not funny at all since you live here too. Hassi and Sauce by here every day to play cards with Ani. What? It's kind of surprised me that he's taken such a liking to the little guy. Before that, I thought the only thing he wanted was a place to contemplate how much other people disappoint him. I'm running kind of low on Sweet Leaf, and by low, I mean I'm totally out. I'm not pointing any fingers, some of my customers have a major sweet tooth. Uh, okay, Sweet Leaf. I have no idea how to get that. No. Okay, gotta ignore the pets, unfortunately, because I don't want to spend any money. If I keep buying all these gifts, I'm gonna run out. I'm gonna run out of money. But let's see if Zeki's got Sweet Leaf. And no Sweet Leaf. I suppose I can take a break for a it's nice to meet you, Corinne. I'm Delilah, mother to An Ani and Nail, wife to Badru, and the boss of this here farm, if you don't mind me saying so. If you ever need a fresh pint of milk or a couple of eggs, be sure to give me a holler. If you see Ani, can you tell him he left his shoes in the hallway again? Your whole family likes it when I make me crab dig, but it's so hard to get a hold of these of the little buggers these days. If you catch any Bahari crabs, I might be very I'd be mighty grateful. Yeah, I'm... I wouldn't know where to catch a Bahari grab, and there's no guidebook here. Can't find any sweet leaf, unfortunately. I'll try and catch another fish. This 
this is this a sweet leaf? No, it's a sun drop lily. Is not in here. Don't know why I thought he was. But he's apparently in here. That's why I got mixed up. What can I do you for? Hey, looks like you came back for a taste of my food. Smart choice. Lucky for you, I always keep a flask or two of soup handy. This week's special is my world-famous vegetable soup. It's been the special at the end eight weeks running. And that's not just because it's one of the few things I know how to make. Here, why don't you take a free sample on the house? So, what do you think? I think I hate tomatoes. I'm just going to say it's delicious. Really? That's a relief. Some find my approach of using lettuce as the sole vegetable in the soup a bit controversial. But I'm glad to see that in the end, I proved the old adage true. You can never go wrong with hot, soggy lettuce. There are a million ways you can go wrong with that. Still, I've been getting some complaints from our regular dinner crew. They beg me to make something literally anything else. But I don't know. No other recipes have really caught my eye. And Kaleri won't let me in the library anymore at the bowl after the bowl of boys incident. Hey, you think you could ask her if she's got any cookbooks available? Maybe I'll get some new inspiration. What? I got new mail too? First things first, I gotta find Kaleri. Yeah, I've been fooled by that quite a few times. And none of these are sweet leaves. Oh, not why I'm here. Calary. Another newcomer, hey? Humph. Perhaps you think this building looks friendly and inviting. Maybe you thought you could even borrow a book or two. Incorrect. A Polyan librarian's job is not to just loan books out willy-nilly. No, she must also guard the knowledge within those sacred tomes. I don't know how they did things where you come from, but we Polyans believe knowledge in the wrong hands can be disastrous. You may peruse the books marked for public use, but you won't see a drop of extra knowledge until I have properly vetted you. Now off you go. I am far too busy to keep coddling you. I'm looking for recipes. Reth put you up to this, didn't he? Hmm, that boy will do anything to wiggle out of his punishment. I still haven't gotten the stains out of the ceiling. Only you can save Kalema from the lettuce minutes. Then perhaps Kalema shouldn't have hired a carpenter to cook. Oh, very well. You may take one and only one. You'll find them on the shelf. And if a single page is returned to me tomato stained, that'll be a lifetime ban for the both of you. Don't forget, I'm watching you. If a book goes missing, I'll know who to blame. When Elios and I were little, we would spend hours at the beach. She always used to search for fragments of shipwrecks. 
said they were all remnants of Gromakin spacecrafts in disguise. At least try to be more respectful of my that might be a little difficult. Do I want dessert or fancy? Chat with Kenyatta. If Kalari sees you talking to me, we're both in trouble, so keep talking. You're here to break up this news fest? I mean, who cares which classic era painting family rose to governess class after the ascension of the first council? Not me. I'm looking for leather if you've got any. I want to hire Jell to make me a new jacket. Always expect the unexpected. I am searching for a paddle flop. Have you seen one around here? Why do you ask? Najima told me that it scores the hills at night. Look for lost socks. Recently, a number of my left socks have gone missing. I am hoping to bargain with the creature to get them back. Alright, I need to get some leather. Oh, I gotta give this cookbook to Reki real quick. Don't know why I thought he was gonna be in there. This compass just confuses me, like a lot. Not in there either. Oh, there he is. Oh, Rath is his name. So, how's life? I brought you a fancy cookbook. Upper crust. A guide to making food for the Majiri elite. How fancy? Do you mind if I call you Fancy Pants? You know what? There's no point in responding. We're gonna call you Fancy Pants out of the way. Oh, and I almost forgot. Here's a bowl of my world-famous vegetable soup, soup to show my eternal gratitude. For some reason, I have a lot left, <laughs> left over. Go figure. Uh -oh. Don't you just love the way the wind whistles through the valley? I'm helping Jell work on his latest looks. I like having a preview of what's coming out next season. If you go out to Bahari Bay, would you mind bringing me back some clay? I need some for a pottery piece I'm working on. Okay, we... Whoa, this is a lot of stuff. It all looks pretty neat, but... I don't have the time right now. Let's see. I think we're gonna sell the soup real quick. Return home. Dear Corinne, here's a little something as thanks for your continued patronage, pal. You've been such a good neighbor. I figured I'd give you a few things to help you get settled into your new home. I better sell some of my old stuff. Oh, or just use it. Hundred fifty three. Yeah, I messed up. I'm gonna get rid of the treasure chest real quick. There. 
Sell the carrots. Sell the onion. Sell the potato, which is kind of a shame because I love potatoes. And last but not least, sell the cotton. I can finally afford that bigger bag. But when will the next shipment be? They say 10 minutes, they mean 10 minutes regular time or 10 minutes game time. Doesn't matter since 21 minutes, but my question still stands. Alright, I'm gonna fish again. small but I got it now I'm just gonna go sell it okay it's gonna take 20 minutes to get this next shipment in I'm gonna get rid of some uh Yeah, I don't got room for the tent. Uh, I figured I can always take it back and... Alright, got rid of all those decorations. No, not all of them. I know, looks pretty bad, but... I have to do this for now, if I want to be able to get gifts for people. All right, everything's red. I guess he gives uh, lucky coins on a regular basis. Okay, I have never heard of Sweet Lee's. I'm gonna, I don't even remember who requested them. I took so many requests, I don't remember who requested what. Imagine that. I'm going to find some more people to request more things from me. So I complete the five, give villagers five gifts west and get that 500 G in my pocket wow look how beautiful this place is Perhaps I may be of assistance. I have been translating many human books we have found in the ruins as of late. And I must say, I am not very impressed with the judgment or intelligence of humans. Your entire civilization was built on folly. No offense. Gina is often digging for things at the beach. Perhaps she is looking for ship fragments? Alright, ship fragments. I don't know how I'm going to find that. But I know where the beach is. Hold on, does anyone else have a quest? Nope, no quest.
Do I go into the beach? I'm gonna... Wait a minute, do I have a shovel? I got a plow thingy. Will that work? Sorry, got a reply on what pad. Actually, it was a OC book somebody published. As soon as I'm done with this video, I'm gonna give a reply on Wattpad real quick. I'm in the middle of this really engaging storyline. I just gotta, I just gotta see how it goes. I remember somebody wanted leather, but... Okay, still waiting to get the money back for that stuff. Meantime, going to Bahara Bay. Woohoo! Does anyone need my help in Bahara Bay? Nope, nobody needs me here. I am going... I got two friends online. I'm a little scared to invite them because I'm such a beginner. <sighs> Can't remember who requested the sweet leaf. Doesn't matter. Can't pick it up. Can go to the bay and collect some ship parts. Even though I don't know how to collect ship parts. And I still gotta finish building my house. Which I can't do until 20 minutes are up. Oh, look at that animal. So cute, but it's so afraid of me. And I don't blame it. Now we are checking out the bay. I think that's a crap. Okay, 
There's a crab, but who requested the crab? I forgot what kind of crab they requested. kidding I totally forgot what the crab was let's see if I can find a ship part found something Got a crab and oysters. Yum. And I say that sarcastically. But more importantly, I got the 500. Woohoo, I'm getting that expanded back. to get that expanded bag I carry more stuff and now on I'm just gonna focus on building my house not the villager gifts I'll worry about the villager gifts after my house is built and I can decorate it with the free trash I ended up getting okay those are crabs Heading back, heading back to the village. As what looks like somebody just came into the village. Someone who is hunting. Probably mad that I disrupted the hunt. But seriously, two friends I have online in Polya. If either one of you want to be fe featured in my videos, just let me know. We can schedule a time. Bunch of names are getting featured on the left side. I know that much. I got no control over that. God, just playing this game just makes me feel so much better. Next is the general store. Or 
where I'm gonna get that upgraded pack. Woohoo, 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 woohoo! get rid of that lucky coin while I'm there. Wow, even the, even the music's soothing. Isn't that awesome? collect the treasure, I get the chest that comes along with it. Okay, do not do this in real life. You would get, you will get banned from the store. Or what I think is a museum. Right now, I gotta get that upgraded bag. Woohoo! Wow, you just got more space. Keep saving to expand your bags even further. I got worms. Never thought I'd say that in a million years. <sighs> Let's get rid of the waypoint. Because I am... Going home if I can find it. Sometimes they mark the home, sometimes they don't. Oh, here it is, my housing plot. Oh, talk to her. Patty, I'm Sifu, the, black, the blacksmith around these parts. But you might recognize me as Sifu, the famous monsters player. I just materialized from a mysterious void. Right, I suppose I can cut you for slack for not recognizing the most famous monster hunter in all 12 provinces. How did a famous monster hunter like me wind up in a quaint suburban hamlet such as this? Well, that's a good question. Fortunately, I have a good answer. See, I became a mother and I realized angry and dangerous beasties was... Well, a little too dangerous for my young son. So I took up the position of the town blacksmith. These days, I make blades instead of wield them. Huh? Good thing you arrived. I could use a spotter. Now, where was I? And I need to head home. Apparently a lot of people are heading home. Some are just leaving it. Let's see, what can I sell? Sell that. I really need the money right now. Do not judge me. These plants don't need to be watered. Ugh, 
100 sapwood planks. How many do I have? 7 minus 100 is 93. That's the wrong thing. Shouldn't be hard to get 93 uh, wood. I wish I could top, chop down some of the bigger trees, though. I guess I gotta pay for an upgrade or something. I'll find out later in the game. Start chopping this guy down. Okay, got getting some sapwood. And some more sapwood. No, just plant fiber. Whoa, cool. I got 240 bin gold from the shipping sales. I need to chop down some bigger trees. All right, 93 sapwood, which I'm getting to quite easily if I at the risk of jinxing it. level three and forging woohoo I just need to get 93 wood yourself a handy dandy Zeki's expanded backpack. How's the extra storage space treating you? No more trips back home every half of the sun cycle, right? Anyway, I just say thanks for being a loyal customer. Okay, water well, the plants real quick. <sighs> yeah, my aim's off, I know. Now my aim's better. Okay. Alright, and the planks are being uh, made. Let's see how much stone I need. Okay, 33 stone. Which, where's our character out getting more than the wood does? Okay. 
almost got the, wow, building this house is a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Got all that. Almost 35. Gotta do is decorate this house and I'll have a house with no furniture in it. Almost a 33. Come on, I need 33. Thirty-two, meaning I only need one more. And now, our trusty smelting machine. Oh, I must put a lot of bricks into it and didn't realize. All right, that's the way to building the house. And as you can see, both machines are working very hard to give me my materials. So this is where i ended because i don't want you watching this whole because i don't want you having to watch this whole thing waiting for my house to be built therefore i okay in, or in a less pretentious way so i'm just gonna end the game here next time i'm gonna have a full built house and i'm gonna figure out i'm gonna figure out how to give four more gifts to villagers and finally get that glider. I figure out how to get the fabric and leather. And this is Suburban Time Waster signing out. Feel free to like, subscribe, and if you want, you can even send me a friend request on Polya.